Turnbull said this week that foreign powers were making unprecedented and increasingly sophisticated attempts to influence the political process in Australia and the world. He cited disturbing reports about Chinese influence. Turnbull, speaking to Parliament on Thursday during the introduction of legislation to stop external interference in domestic politics, reiterated those concerns. Media reports have suggested that the Chinese Communist Party has been working to covertly interfere with our media, our universities and even the decisions of elected representatives right here in this building. We take these reports very seriously, he said. Chinese Foreign Ministry spokesman Zhang Shuag said in Beijing he was shocked by what Turnbull had said. We express strong dissatisfaction at this and have already lodged solemn representations with the Australian side. Zheng told a daily news briefing. Zheng said China had always respected the principle of non-interference in internal affairs when dealing with Australia. We strongly urge the relevant Australian person to spurn Cold War thinking and prejudice towards China, immediately stop making wrong comments that harm political mutual trust and mutually beneficial cooperation and take effective steps to dispel negative effects, he said. Jenks remarks were China's latest and strongest broadside against Australia on the issue. The Chinese embassy in Australia on Wednesday accused Australia of hysteria and paranoia after Turnbull vowed to ban foreign political donations to curb external influence in domestic politics. China's soft power has come under renewed focus this week after Labor Senator Sam Dasgeri was demoted to the opposition backbench after being found to have warned a prominent Chinese business leader and Communist Party member his phone was being tapped by intelligence authorities. In June, Fairfax Media and the ABC reported on a concerted campaign by China to infiltrate Australian politics to promote Chinese interests.